away, you bastards. Give up your colony plans. Light and man, sir. That's why you need an Omnigel programming solution that works. Whether constructing single-use equipment or breaking down salvaged gear, Cision technology will be there for you. There's a problem with Omnigel can solve for everything else. my way. Look at how the wind's blowing. I... well, I guess it's not like I attack those colonies. I'm looking for the best tech upgrades you have. Of course. I can help you with the consult and figure out what options work for you. The data is vital to the Kurosa family. Asana Dantius didn't give us time to pack. I don't know, that still sounds like an awful thing to legalize. All the dangers are right there on the package. It's legally required. Who needs labels, though? So consider it a way to weed out the people too stupid to know their limits. Make it as a commando? Why not? Maybe a shirt. Or a card. Ilium. Hey, you're blue shifting already. That's funny, right? A sorry skin color and the Doppler effect? Dad, just get her anything. Or it's just we're looking for weapons. Shouldn't you be taking this seriously? Hey, sometimes you say these things, and I don't know. Maybe it's because you had a Batarian father. Wow. You're pulling that on me? My father. She's the last of a dying breed. Won't be many pure blood Asari left in a few generations. I feel kind of sad for her. Don't. I heard she married an Asari herself, had pure blood kids. She's part of the problem. I'm telling you, relax. Dax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crime scene. It's all locked down. Eclipse marks some just. Hey, we're friends. I have never called you that. No, but you're thinking about it. You think it was easy growing up pure blood? I did some stupid things to get away from the taunts. Stupid drugs you're laughing at. I might be one. I need minimal heat increase and speed. I have extremely high performance. Serve somebody who respects you. Somebody who's going to treat you right. Oh, I think I'm just going to stop dating for a while. No, don't do that. Don't let some humans spoil you. It's always the same thing. Flashier. I want something that says, I own this room. I own you. 
25. Sell at 25. No, no, no. You're not hearing me. I want to buy it up. Shepard, it's good to see you again. So, what can I do for you? How's your own work going? Everyone needs and It should be about friendship. Let me know when you hack those terminals. Give me that. And if it'll help you, I'll you... take care of it. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great... Data is vital to the Carosa family. Nasana Dantius didn't give us time to pack. Look, I'll take another look at the contract. Maybe it needs to be reclassified. Forget it. Do whatever you want. Pure bloods are a waste of genetic potential. That's how we get throwbacks like the Ardat Yakshi. Hey, I don't like pure bloods either, but that's going a little far. They should be prohibited from breeding. What was your father again? Salarian. Oh. So. I'm telling you, relax. Vax will never notice a few missing pieces. No, I can't get in. Because it's a crime scene. It's all locked down. Eclipse Mercs, some Justicar, I don't know. Nobody is ever going to see the extra murder. Eclipse might be fun for you. For me, it's the future. My clan's breeding strategy is at stake. Don't Solarians think about anything besides breeding? Don't even start with me. Sure, gateway weapons and armor are good enough for Eclipse? Yeah, I've got a friend in Eclipse. She told me what I needed to get. Trust me, the goods coming in from the Terminus systems are great for business. Shepard, this is Liara. I've got the data. Come see me when- For example, you know that new drug, the one that causes permanent neural scarring? That's horrible. There's a 12-page contract for shipping, then a waiver for use. Shepard, it's good to see you again. Thank you for getting me that system data. Here, it's not much, but hopefully it will help you on your mission. Do you remember the Shadow Broker? With the data you got me, I may be able to find information caches from his agents. 
Are you on the run from the Shadow Broker? I can help you. Actually, it would be more accurate to say that the Shadow Broker is on the run from me. We crossed paths not long after you died. Since then, I've been working to take him down. With this data, I'm a step closer. I've never seen you ready to execute someone in cold blood. What did the Shadow Broker do to you? I was on a job with a friend. The Shadow Broker's people caught us. My friend didn't escape. I don't know if he's dead or being interrogated. But I need to find him. I owe him my life. And I need to make the Shadow Broker pay for what he did. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. Thanks, Shepard. I will. No. Is there anything else I can help you with? I'll talk to you later, Liara. Listen, I know the data is vital to the Carosa family. Asana Dantius didn't give us time to pass. You can sell something that dangerous with just a contract and a waiver? These are the Terminus systems. Everything. Did you get the star charts? Yeah. I had to... Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or... Did she kill somebody already? Relax. I just need to speak with her. Good. Samara's the first Justicar I've seen on Ilium. If I'm lucky, things will stay peaceful. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. Is Samara really that dangerous? If you follow the laws, you've got nothing to fear, and a Justicar would die without hesitation to protect the innocent. But their code orders them to stop lawbreakers, with lethal force in most cases, and everyone skirts the law somehow on Ilium. If someone tried to bribe her, she'd be obliged to gun them down as a matter of honor. I'm hoping to avoid that. Why are you worried about other species coming into contact with her? If a Justicar kills an Asari, none of us questions it. But if she killed a human... Do you think the Alliance would understand her actions and respect her authority? You can't even figure out your own religions! It's a big, diplomatic incident just waiting to happen. Tell me about the Justicars. They're a monastic order. They've given up their families and possessions to follow their code. Most of them are on some lifelong mission, but they'll always stop to deal with any injustice they encounter, which can be a problem. In some ways, they're a lot like the Spectres, undertaking personal missions. Spectres are authorized by the Council. Who do Justicars represent? What? That's, like, I don't know a good human metaphor. They represent their code, our code. It's closer to a religious group than a legal branch. No law-abiding Asari would question a Justicar's orders. Nobody becomes a Justicar for personal gain. And they die before breaking their oaths. Where do you think you're going? I'm taking my goods to Omega, Detective. You're not going anywhere, Merchant. Not until I solve this murder. I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. The victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. I'll let you know when you can leave. What about that Justicar that just showed up? Everyone says she might go crazy and start killing. I need to leave. 
She'll only kill the unjust, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. What do you want? I've already got mercs wanting to kill me like they did my partner. I don't need any more trouble. As if that weren't enough, some Asari Justicar showed up this morning. All the natives are scared of her. I've got to get off of this world. Tell me how to find the Justicar. She's in the alley where my business partner was murdered. A detective sealed the area, so you'll have to talk with her if you want to go there. You don't seem too broken up about your partner's death. Dakni Kerr knew the risks when he took to spacing. Right now, my worry is me. It's unhealthy to be a Volus in the Nosastra spaceport right now. Especially a Volus named Pitney Four. Why would these mercs kill him? And why do you think they're coming after you, too? I have no idea. We're innocent merchants. But they killed him, so they must be after me, too. I have to work the angles and get out of here. Why do you think it was mercenaries? Dakni Kerr was cutting through a back alley last night when someone killed him with a shotgun. I saw his body this morning. They'd used modded rounds. That means Eclipse mercs. You must know something about these Eclipse. I occasionally do business with them, but only in well-lit places, with my guards, and only after the creds clear. This is a scummy bunch, even by Merc standards. They sell red sand, all kinds of illegal items, and they are all cold-blooded killers. I should.